Casey of Party Gecko Enterprises, and today we're going to be talking about how geckos stick to walls. This is Emerson, she's a New Caledonian crested gecko, and she's going to be helping me out today. On the bottom of a gecko's foot, there are millions of tiny little hairs called setae. Each setae is the length of two diameters of human hair, or one one hundred millionth of a meter long. They're really, really tiny. At the end of each setae, it splits into approximately 1,000 tiny, tiny little hairs called spatulae. These spatulae are so small, we can't see them. They're microscopic. But what they do is they increase the surface density of a gecko's foot at a microscopic level. Scientifically, van der Waals forces are electrodynamic forces which operate at very small distances and create an attraction between the two surfaces. The surface of a gecko's foot has been increased on such a level that they adhere to the wall. If a gecko was using all of its spatulae at the same time, the adhesion would be so strong that it could withstand probably the force of a 280 pound human being. Now luckily, there's no geckos that weigh about 280 pounds, uh, but that's the truth, so now you know. Have a great day.